Well, um, I wanted to keep the the focus of this channel strictly towards comics and pop culture. Um, but as many of you know, uh, I served as an artillery captain uh, in the Marine Corps for about five years uh, with combat deployments to Baghdad, Iraq, and Djibouti, Africa. Um, so naturally, my, my point of view on this channel and about pretty much everything is comes from like a military perspective um, or a military background. And I, I kind of wanted to keep my life in the military separate from my life on YouTube, um, kind of keeping those separate and having like a another identity, like Clark Kent and Superman, if you will. Um, but obviously that's not an option anymore after what happened the other day. Um, the purpose of this video isn't to give uh, like my take on the situation um, or like what we could have done to try and prevent this because obviously that video would have taken it's it would take years for me to go over everything but um i just wanted to put this out to say i want to continue making videos i want to continue to laugh and smile and stream and talk about the things that mean the most to me um which are comic books superheroes movies pop culture in general and I found a fellowship here that I feel comfortable doing that with. And um, I feel like that's really going to be the thing that keeps me sane during all this time. Um, so I will, like I said, I, I want to continue to make videos um, because I, I love what I do here. Um, and I love the fellowship that I've become a part of uh, with the things that we talk about and the things that we love. So, um, but yeah, like I said, I, I'm not going to add my thoughts or my opinions into this because that's a video for another day. Or if you want to private message me, like that's fine too. And we can talk about it through there. But on this channel, I think, um, I just want to say that for my Marine Corps brothers and sisters who I served with and those who I didn't serve with but are still active or even reserve or retired, I love you and I care about you and I'm thinking about you. Um, this sucks for all of us and that's an understatement. And so that's why I don't feel like I can be silent about this anymore. I'm going to I may not talk about it a lot, but if it comes up, you best believe I'm going to mention it and I'm going to state how I feel, which is um, a lot of anger, a lot of frustration. Um, and it came and the news came with a lot of tears as well. Um, the picture I posted in, in, in the thumbnail it's actually of uh, five of my Marines that I deployed with. Obviously, I blurred out their faces, just not so that I, you know, so that I could keep their identities to themselves and not dox them. But I, one of the Marines in that picture is currently deployed in Afghanistan and witnessed what happened the other day. Um, he suffered no physical injuries, thankfully, but obviously is very shaken up and I'm in direct contact with him and it's been really hard on those guys and, um, on, and I couldn't even imagine what their families are dealing with. Like I said, I'm, I'm angry. I'm really angry, of course, uh, because just a few weeks ago we get tweets from Kamala Harris saying, enjoy the long weekend, not mentioning our service members who gave their life for this country. Um, we have TikTok videos of idiots parading around the White House, acting like all oh, this is a joke. We have recruiting videos of 
army enlisted or enlisted men and women that are more focused on representation than actual soldiers who can fight in battle. All while my brothers are being killed. All while my brothers are being murdered in a foreign country. And these people are are making jokes and TikTok videos and are more concerned about virtue signaling and identity politics more than anything else. So I'll end with this. Please pray for the Marines and the civilians that are over there and all the service members that are over there currently. Um, and please pray for the families that are about to hear the news of what has happened to all my Marine brothers and sisters. Like I said before, I love you all and I'm praying for you all. Uh, so I just, like I said, I wanted to make a video addressing this so that I can move forward, continue to make videos on this, uh, on this channel and that you guys know somewhat of where I'm coming from and, and somewhat of my thoughts and feelings on the situation. But other than that, all I have to say is, um, Semper Fidelis and until Valhalla.